Is that a well? Well, well, well. <laughs> hey, what are you doing? It might come in handy. What have we here? Hey, Sully, throw the car in reverse. Okay, give me a second. <clears throat> So? Nothing major. I'll show you back at the hotel. Hey, Sam. If you don't mind me asking, how'd you pass the time in prison? Uh, you know, reading, mostly. There was just one guard saw me as a charity case, I guess. He had to check out books from the library for me. So what'd you read? History, uh, especially anything related to Avery and other pirates, just in case, you know. Sure. But, you know, besides books, push-ups, smoking, trying to stay out of fights between rival gangs, it's a whole lot of thinking. It's pretty much it. Sam, if you had a guard doing you favors, why didn't you use him to get word to us? Oh, I tried. I asked him to mail a letter to your P.O. box. I never got it. That would be because the warden saw it. I got busted up pretty bad and never saw that guard again. Jesus. I got my own back when the warden decided to room me with Alcazar. That didn't turn out how he expected. You know, come to think of it, I actually dealt with Alcazar a few decades ago, <laughs> even before I met you two. Oh, shit. How are you still alive? Well, he wasn't quite the man he is today. Still working his way up the criminal ladder then. I sold his boss a few woodcut prints I'd smuggled out of Japan. He was into shoguns and such. Alcazar was the go-between. What was he like? Soft-spoken, but intense. Like he could explode at the slightest provocation. Ah, hell. See that smoke? Oh, shoreline, slow down. <laughs> oh, uh, <laughs> hey, Nathan, you maybe you want to ease up? Uh, Victor, you were saying? Right. Soft-spoken, but intense. Like you could explode at the slightest provocation. <laughs> well, he hasn't changed much then, has he? I got my money and got the hell out of there. So, Pyro walks into a bar. Okay, here we go. And he's got the steering wheel sticking out of his crotch. All right. So the bartender goes, hey, man. Whoa! Looks like Shoreline found something. Go slow. You got it. Oh, shoreline comes. Yeah. Take a picture of me. Give me a break. This is a rape request. Every site needs to be documented before we use explosives. Oi! They're right here! Hey. Oh. Nathan, move! Oh.
we're clear. talking about um oh right so the bartender goes hey man what's with the wheel and the pirate says back ah he's driving me nuts <laughs> ah, i love that one don't make me leave you out here <clears throat> buckle up everybody Check it out, boys. What is it? Hey, guys, there's another tower just over the hill. See any shoreline, Mercs? Can't tell. Well, it would appear we got here first. Let's uh, check the place out and keep moving. Drawbridge? How medieval. Yeah. Well, you don't put up a drawbridge unless you're trying to keep people out. Or protect something inside. Hey, Nathan! Come check this out! Hey, be careful, kid. Nathan, 
the stairs are busted. There's no way up to the drawbridge crank. All right, I'll see if there's something up here. Hey, kid, you see a big crate or something way up at the top of the tower. Maybe that'll do the trick. Another sigil. So, do you recognize this one? I do, actually. And Bonnie. Mm hmm? Operated out of the Caribbean. Thought she died in jail. At least that's what the stories tell us. <laughs> right. Avery must have invited her, too. Hey guys, there's a massive tower just past the drawbridge. Biggest one yet. Bingo. Sam, special delivery. Whoa, 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 whoa. Hey kid, you all right? I'm fine. You all right? Yeah. You got this? Mm-hmm. I seen a few. I'll bring the car closer. Are you two just relax? I got this. I mean, there's only one crank, you know? <laughs> Keep up the good work, kid. Ah, stop! Show it! Oh, no. Guys! Ah!
Target spotted! Come on! Shepard! Oh. Put them down! Get that bridge down. Let's try that again. Go. Big tower on a volcano. Looks like the end's in sight, huh? You know, not to nitpick, but Avery spent all that money on towers. Would it have killed him to put a guardrail up here? A try. Gonna take a look around. Don't spin out now. So, just how much do you owe Alcazar? Uh, half. Half of what? Well, he only knows about the Gunsway heist. Which is worth 400 million. Right, but if Nathan's theory is correct, then there's a lot more treasure at play. Well, you should have told him it was 200,000. You never tell your partners how much a job is really worth. I wasn't exactly expecting to be partnered. Guys, we're going to find it, pay off that lunatic, and still have plenty to spare. Trust me.
There we go. We're all set. Here we go. Uh-oh. <laughs> I got mud in my mouth. Fun, right? Yeah, well, I'm definitely sharing this one with my shrink. <laughs> Wait, you have a shrink? No, but I will after this. Come on, you guys are overreacting. Had the whole thing under control. <laughs> Hold on to something. Oh! Ah. Oh, that was a nice change of pace. Yeah, I'm almost. Disappointed. Uh, uh, almost. <laughs> Sorry. This is where we get off, kid. Now, let's find our way in. Let's go claim our treasure, boys. Hmm. Can't get in that way. Sam, give me a hand with this. Yeah. Let's see what we got here. Huh. Like there's something back here. Sam? Yeah. Let's do this. Breaked over. All right, let's look around. Hey, careful with that thing, kid. <sighs> heads up! God, Jesus! I said heads up! Come on! Right there, this way. You 
Seems excited. Uh, he's got a lot riding on this. Don't see a treasure, though. Hey guys, coming. <laughs> Come check this out. Saint Dismas. We meet again. So, what do we got? More sigils. There's our boy Avery. Thomas too. And that's, uh... Um... That's Adam Baldridge, that's uh, Joseph Farrell, and that's Richard Warren. Hmm. Pirate captains. All right, so maybe your pirate pool theory wasn't so ridiculous after all. <laughs> all right, so, uh... Let's see, what do you think the trick is here? Gotta push a button, pull something? Uh, maybe... Maybe one of the arms, or... Yeah, give it a shot. Whenever you're done fondling poor St. Dismas, I think you might want to come take a look at this. The trapezoid is obviously the volcano. The crown, that's King's Bay. We got ourselves a map, gentlemen. Victor, you're a goddamn genius. Hear that, Nate? Genius. Yeah, yeah. Okay, so if we're here, this tower lines up with Avery's sigil. Okay, so then the other sigils must be the towers from Avery's time. Well, I mean, a treasure's got to be in one of them, right? Yeah, but which one? I count 12 towers. Hey, uh, Victor? Huh? You didn't start smoking cigarettes by any chance, did you? Looks like we're not the first ones here. Jesus. Is that all of them? Well, let's hope so. You okay? Yeah, yeah, fine. Sam? Yeah, over here. Hey, what are you doing? He's confirming a suspicion. <clears throat> Look at this.
They figured out the towers, too. Locations, sigils, the works. So now what? Now what? Now we're screwed. Okay, because there's three of us, and there's God knows how many of them, and they have a head start? Yeah, but they don't know which tower to go to yet. Less great, Nathan, because neither do we. Yes, we do. <laughs> Look, it's a little worn down. Right there, that's a match. Yeah, you sure? Because, I mean, it could be this one, too. Crap. Yeah, but still, two beats the hell out of 12. All right, I'm gonna take this tower. You and Sully, you take that one. No, 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 no. no, no Rafe's guys are all over these towers by now. Exactly, so if we want to have a chance to catch them, then we've got to split up. Sam, just hold up a second, will you? Nate, he's right. These towers are at opposite ends of King's Bay. Damn it. Uh, if you run into any of those shoreline clowns, you call us, okay? See you soon. There's our tower. You really think all that treasure's gonna be just sitting in the middle of a goddamn market? Oh, yeah, that'd be crazy. But we've seen crazy before. That we have. <laughs> 